Hi, I'm Sydney. And I'm Jamie. And, and welcome, welcome to, to AM Central. Central. Attention seniors, if you have received an award letter from a college, make sure to give it to Miss Howard in room 126 so she can make sure which college is the best for your family financially. Sophomores and juniors, please sign up in guidance for a big college fair field trip on April 8th and anyone is welcome to go. Underclassmen, if you are interested in a future in health and medi or medicine, then and are looking for an elective for next year, then Health 2 might be for you. Come see Ms. Bowen in 304 if you have any questions. My name is Emmy Sharp and I've played piano for a little over 10 years. I started when I was around seven, eight years old because my mom asked me and my siblings if we wanted to take up music because it would be good for the future. So we did and I took up piano. Well, when you were in the third grade, I asked you if there was an instrument that you were interested in playing. And you had your option to pick any instrument out there, and you said you want to play piano. I was really happy when you said, I want to learn how to play piano. Well, I was glad that uh, you decided to take on some type of uh, instrument. So I took lessons, I learned, I improved, and then there came a point where I could be able to participate in competition. So I did competitions, I did recitals, and I played for fun. And I would get up there and play and just enjoy it because it was a wonderful experience for me, but I do not do these competitions anymore. Whatever, however you performed, I, I, I'd be proud. And I would hope that you would be proud of yourself as well. And proud. Proud. I was a proud dad. I enjoyed uh, you playing and in front of everybody. Let people see what you can do. I won many trophies and partition, uh, participation awards over the years because of doing this. I love looking at them sometimes here and there because it recognizes that I've done something with my love for piano. But over the past few years, I actually have not been playing the piano as much as I would love to. It actually started depleting when my grandmother died. She inspired me to keep playing because she loved hearing me play so much. Every time I would play upbeat songs or her favorite songs, she would dance next to me. And I would love that feeling, just looking at the corner of my eye and seeing her dance. And I was thinking of actually quitting piano once she did pass. But then I realized how much she loved me playing, so I continued for a few more years on. When uh, Grandma, that's my mom, would come over, she would always ask you to play, and you know how proud she was to hear anything that you played. And uh, she was kind of funny because if, if it was a song with a catchy tune, she would stand by the piano and kind of start dancing <laughs> to your playing. And uh, she, she just loved anything you played on that piano. And she was really appreciative of, of any song that you played for her. We miss her a lot too, because Grandma had a great influence on you. And I think on your playing as well. Uh, Grandma passed away about five years ago at age 92. And um, I still think of her when I see you play. Your Grandma enjoyed every minute you hit a key. She loved listening to you, no matter how bad you were or how good you were. I love playing for my family and for friends. It's an amazing feeling when I get to create something, either if it's just with the fingers on the notes that I play that someone else already written or I write them. I love that feeling that I get to share something that I enjoy 
with someone else who loves to hear me playing the music with just pressing the simple key. Playing for people, but I don't have that chance to do it anymore because I feel as I play, I'll forget it, a note or mess up, and I'll just disappoint them. But I love it. I still love playing, even though I haven't played in a while. It just brings back so many good memories for me. And as I grow older, I hope to keep the piano and the music I grew up with in my life. I never want to let go of what I've learned, and I always want to improve more. Even if I'm not doing competitions or doing anything or playing for anyone, it's something that I enjoy myself. And it would be devastating for me if I would ever give up the music in my life. For you, Joanne Sharp, my mother, and Angela Konezny, my grandmother, I play for you. That's all for now, Central. Have a great day.